Hello guys, it's Ishuto and in today's video I am not continuing the series but on the request of some people I'm gonna do a guide on how to play Sacred online in 2020. So this is the this is the guy you're looking for, Redmin VPN. So what you are going to do is you go in here, Redmin VPN. You Google it, and from here you download it. And after you download it, you install it. The installation is uh, quite a straightforward process. After that, you open it and um, it shouldn't uh, it shouldn't be a problem to use it right away because you don't need to register to Redmin so you just open it you right click you can change your name to whatever you want I named myself to Kakayashi for whatever reason and then what you're going to do you go on network you go to join an existing network and you can go to you can uh, go to the search bar make sure you're in the uh, gaming network tab and search for sacred and you can find sacred underworld and sacred you can join both of these and this way you are going to be connected with everybody who plays sacred and sacred underworld so you'll be able to see them in your server list. Now, one more thing you need to do is you go to um, the control panel. You search for network and sharing center. In here, you should now have Redmin as soon as you install it. You press on it, you go to properties, then here you find Internet Protocol version 4 TCP slash IPv4. You press on it and then you go to properties and you'll see this. Here you go on advanced and here you have to make sure that the automatic metric is not ticked. And here the interface metric says 1 after that you press ok ok close close and that is it that's about this bit so um, after doing these couple of steps depending on how you got sacred you can go into its library through different ways I got my sacred from Steam so I right click here I go on properties, I go local files, browse flat files, and here you can see these files here. This is the library of sacred, and there's the path if you're interested. So here you are going to change three of the files in here. You want to have this open. So First thing is you go to games game server dot cfg. Then you want to make sure that you copy the IP address and you paste it on the network IP address as well as the network lobby. So both of these and make sure you maintain the space as well. Then you're going to do the same with the settings G, uh, CGF, CFG. Here you will find the IP address and the lobby. Then again, if you got it from Steam, then chances are you also have the Steam settings CGF, CFG. So you go on here as well. And you also change the IP and the lobby to your IP. This way, other people will be able to join your server if you make one. Now, 
after doing all of this, if you go into your sacred, in my case, it's the modded sacred, sacred reborn. <clears throat> Let's say go in here, why not? So here I can see a couple of servers out there and these are not mine. These are different people's servers. And uh, in case you can't join and you see these exclamation marks, they can be for different reason. In my case, wrong version. Why? Because I'm playing Reborn. I'm not playing the, I'm, I'm not in the vanilla sacred right now. I'm in the Reborn version of sacred right now. And those are level limitations. Also, you want to make sure that you select the ISDN slash modem when you try to join somebody's server, not LAN. Now, another potential issue. For some people, it still may not work. What you can do is here you type firewall. You go on firewall and network protection. This will lead you here. So you might want to experiment with this. And start, you might want to turn all of, all of these three off. So go on domain, turn it off, yes. Back, private network, turn it off, yes. And then public network, also turn it off, yes. And then you can try again. Now let's turn all of these back on, because I don't need to turn it off to be able to play. Now, <clears throat> if somebody cannot join your server, that's usually because you either have the wrong IP in place, or you have your uh, or their firewall is blocking their connection to you, or your firewall is blocking your connection to them, and it can also be the fact that you um, have a balance modification in place which the game server list should indicate as they try to join you and if you can't join somebody else's server that's because their IP is wrong or firewall is blocking the connection from one way or the other or again, because there's a modification in place. There is nothing else that should be preventing your connection with others. So yeah, uh, thank you very much guys for watching this tutorial. I hope it helps, I hope it will help you with uh, playing Sacred online with others. Should you have any issues, let me know in the comment section and Maybe I'll be able to help. But that's it from me. Thank you very much.